this is an effects unit. It's gonna make it sound like different rooms and sizes and material. These are all presets. That's an EQ equalizer unit, 700 watt amp, audio mixer, this is basically the controls for the whole thing other than the EQ which is pretty much static, you don't need to change much. This, these are the master volumes, each one of these is an input channel, this particular one the computer is coming in on here. And this particular mixer, it only has a F, mono FX send, but also has a monitor. To get stereo out of this, I used both these. And I set these two knobs here. Monitor FX is maxed out, monitor is quarter way up. Those send out to these adjustments, which is basically a volume control there too. But I set these knobs up here like that so that these are equal. Otherwise, the monitor is way pow more powerful than the FX or vice versa. I forget. And one thing I did find out I had originally had the FX instead of the aux return, I had it coming in a channel. And if I had turned it up, I turned these up, and that was wrong because I'd get a feedback loop going. And I f forgot I had the aux, aux return, which doesn't actually have a slider for that particular channel. It just comes into the bus, and these are the adjustments for that. This is the main output. There's also one more volume adjustment I could do on the back of the amp. This is at about, I think, quarter or half, because it was, it, this thing could go insanely loud if I wanted to. And this is where you put microphones and instruments, guitars, whatever, and for inputs. And then the XLRs out there go to the amp, actually go to the effects, go to the amp via the equalizer. And that's in the middle of the two. But this is basically a small PA system set up now.